why I ever say the film was shot in front of a live studio audience. Feel like this way about you guys about my core friends like we have a group chat that we text every day and about the couple that were that we married and there's another couple that moved to puerto rico that we're pretty close but talking yeah. consistently it has to be this this group oh yeah it's oh, just yeah. super consistent it's where i share all super my just like quick thoughts too because i'm like it's the, the group the yeah, who I else share, who I, else is gonna like, like my I, tweet no, about food with, there's Ryan. nothing too dark or too fucked up to say to you guys <laughs> <laughs> um, we have, yeah. man, we I have just some, I just can't so. go out. I just can't go a single day without posting food and knowing that Brian saw it. I just I just <laughs> and, can't go. And I, guys, I was make I was putting those pictures and I'm putting in my album and then I started thinking. I thought about that tweet while I was at work and I thought about it all day and I'm like I cannot <laughs> wait to post this stupid tweet about how I like did an even dumber thing than you said. <laughs> And guys, I put pictures that... of food amongst my friends and loved ones. <laughs> yes. Can we and circle guys, back to our event? I remember that is what Peter oh, played. Oh, there's a movie, right? There's a movie, right? Sydney Fife. So okay. I remember this movie came out just as I what when when this came out ten years ago. 2011. Nine. 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 Yeah. All right, no. So it wasn't the cusp. It was probably two years or a year and a half after I found Rush. And okay. it was like the perfect, just like marriage of because That's I was. That's why I remember role models because I'm such a kiss guy that like that movie's kind of forgettable, but I remember I'm, how much yeah. they like, dig in on the kiss. <laughs> I knew two musician got like they weren't friends of mine, but like I knew who they were. They were a year older than me. Two musician guys in my high school that were obsessed with Rush in the way these guys are obsessed Rush with so Rush. Good. Dude, because when musically came... Rush is like like I love Kiss, but Kiss is like here, and musically Rush is like way up here. Oh, really. dude. when they came oh, to Puerto wow. Rico, it was like the most I've ever spent on a concert. Like it was like I think it was a two hundred dollar ticket. Holy shit. I was gonna be in the fucking like there. Okay, are you in the grass yeah. or are you like front row? I was, I, but can I just say about the movie though? I do love the scene when he introduces uh, her to Rush. That. Oh, and, that, that and, felt and, so reminiscent of yes. like, and listen, he's like, it's better on Listen to this speakers. podcast I really like, or something like that. Felt like that same vibe of like Dude, you're trying it, to introduce was, someone to something the, you it, love. It, um, it was the exact same feeling of putting on a movie, and five minutes in, your wife goes. Every one of my <laughs> actually one of my. <laughs> so I said we quote this. Movie you're like movie. you're like. But but the movie the movie's good. This, movie, this, this scene's gonna be really good. It's like two it's minutes. It's funny. Like, it's funny. Watch. watch. You watching? Um, this watch movie it. though, uh, like I said, it gets quoted all the time. Like I feel like scene for scene almost. Like you remember even at the wedding when someone came up to me and was like, "No, everyone was looking each other's bases." Like the <laughs> the complete ignoring of your wife. Like I've been there with friends and we quoted that. But like, no man, everyone was looking each other's. Lots of guys were looking each other's bases. <laughs> um. Yeah, it, just a lot of things like that. Although there is another one I quote all the time, and no one ever knows it's a quote. Anytime anyone's ever done, like, all right, on three, Wait, like, let's name, our, let's name our favorite, uh, like, scary movie. I'm just like, Beatles, Stones, go. And it's like, fuck <laughs> you. I, get... <laughs> I love it. Beatles, Stones, go all in. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Nobody has any. Like John Trevor just has zero time for his bullshit. It's so good. Um, I also do the bit. I love, and it's always good. Anybody who leaves like a really long, awkward phone message or like makes multiple phone messages, I feel like that having John Favreau in your movie and having that in your movie has to be a sliders or a, uh, a, a swingers reference. Probably. Like you almost can't. You're like you know what you're doing, right? Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> John Favreau has one of the best one of those of all time in Swingers. It's so good. I don't know if you're going to show up or you aren't. Like, he's <laughs> like, uh, maybe I'll see you there. Maybe I won't. And he's like, wait, are you going to show up? Like, <laughs> he's like, what are we doing? It's so good. All right. Uh, anything else you want to guys? No, uh, I just want to read this. Like, it's, it's Oh, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Read, read the burp. All right. I can't believe, because this movie, I think, even if you didn't like it, you probably don't consider it this. What's the overall but, tomato score on this one? Is it pretty decent? Um, if, Yeah, it's like an 87 and like a 74, yeah. I That's think. Not That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Yeah. I agree. Um, charmless and abysmally unfunny from one end to the next. Condescension and desperation seeping from its filmic pores. At this early date in March, it is the year's first lock for December's annual worst list. First of all, wow. no Paul Rudd movie is charmless because no, yeah. Paul Rudd <laughs> exudes charm. He can't help it. He I thought it was funny problem. that Paul Rudd was playing the nerd in this. He kind of plays the cool guy a lot of times. I'm glad you know Paul I mean? Rudd did this also movie before like Ant Man shape because he's like oh sure sure yeah he's, he's just like not in shape enough where you're like yeah I know everyday that guy everyday yeah. guy and it's it's the best. Who the, fuck, who the fuck said that? Just, just put him or her day on blast. Uh, yeah, put this motherfucker on Dustin, blast. They probably don't even have this site anymore. Dustin Putman, the film file. His name com. is fucking Dustin. That's a verb. You dust things. That's not a name. <laughs> How about you dust right? his You ball. clearly didn't grow up in the country. Dustin is definitely a name. It's God definitely. Damn it, Brian, be on um, my side. We're friends. I love you, man. Um, that was very right. toxic. So, I could... I, <laughs> talk about this movie all day let's go into the ratings ratings oh oh me oh yeah no close on me because i'm gonna do the horror franchise stuff oh yeah oh yes uh i mean it's a great movie we definitely dived into our own friendships and the whole like wedding more than the film that was fine because the point of the movie Yes, and that, uh, this movie's, I don't think it's going to be anything less than a 7.8. Uh, I'm going to give it 8.1. Uh, this is awesome. This is awesome. <laughs> yeah. You know? That's gotcha. a good one. Brian. Right. Yep. Me? Oh, um, like I said, only a second time watch for me, but I do feel like it held up very well and it had a little interesting. The one criticism I would make is that I think the fight and breakup with Sydney is enough. I don't think they needed to do the bit where he fights with the his, his fiance yeah. too. It feels like too much. Yeah. It's could, like it's like that, that. This movie's not about that. That core that you know. But it was fine. I, I mean, it plays out okay because like they have a reason for it. He said it because. But yeah, it's it's we fine. Didn't mention, we didn't mention the the billboards. Yeah, no boys. Boys. Funny the enough. leprechaun gag is it's and also a great. Running and also, bit. I'm sorry, I'm I'm hijacking Brian's score, but we didn't mention the the J.K. Simmons and Andy Samberg relationship. And like, Lucas, great friendship. Like he's gay, that's but a great he's friendship like, yeah, right there. Like absolutely. <laughs> and, and I was telling Harrison friend, about that. I was like, Lucas. I was like, hey, I just watched a movie where a grown man was best friends with his dad, so it could happen for us. Yeah. <laughs> and Hank Bardukas. Like, yeah, yeah. Of course, there'll always be a Hank Bardukas. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, I'd give this. I'd probably give this like a like a seven point five uh, oh. slap in the face. I said there's no the low at seven point eight. You went, yeah, nothing. Yeah, <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm gonna be really high on this. It just it's for that many times I've watched it for how prevalent. I think it's a tight ninety. I, it's actually an know. hour and forty four minutes, Joe. Oh, I'm so sorry. It's not. <laughs> so it feels like a tight ninety, right? That's a good sign. Um. I am gonna give this. We didn't even talk about Rob Hubel just being the perfect douchebag, Tevin and Lou Ferrigno. Oh yeah, and, uh, that. as the realtor. Uh, what's your urinal cake situation like? Anyway, yeah. because Lou Ferrigno <laughs> is a real life douchebag, <laughs> so there's like some synergy there. Um, I am I am going to give this a solid. This is for me. Solid 
nine uh, grandmas riding a Sibian machine. <laughs> um, like a porcupine. She's a bush like a porcupine, Peter. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I, I'm, I'm, I'm right there with them. Uh, I really enjoy it. I bought it, the, the Blu-ray and every now and then I pop it in and it's just it's like, it's a nice looking brewery too. It's kind of like, uh, like, uh, like a Sarah Silva saving, uh, forgetting Sarah Montreal, uh, or yes. one of those type of movies that I can easily watch. Like any time of the day. Movies, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm going to give it eight, uh, RIP, the greatest drummer in the world, Neil Pearl. Uh, eight out of ten. Uh, so now moving Who's on. So, huh? The Who's Rush that? Brummer. Oh, Trevor. Yeah, the Trevor Rush. He's passed away stopped. just a few. Just not wait, 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 last year. January you want some Neil Pertall up in you? No, Neil I don't know who that is. All right, so um, uh, I get to do the horror episode yeah, again. Just pick them. Yeah. Um. So this time around, I didn't do a, a whole spiel because honestly, I've been tired and <laughs> I've been doing too much shit at the I'm same time. I'm fucking busy, okay? <laughs> okay, I'm busy. So I got my New Jersey hat here, and there's a bunch of franchises here. So uh, I'm gonna pick three names out of the franchise for each of you, and you get to pick what you want. Oh, nice. But oh. those three will be eliminated for the rest of the guys. Keep that in mind. Oh, okay. okay. All right. Who's first? Uh, let's, let's do point. Joe since it's Joe's episode. Joe's okay. special day. Hey. All right, you got three names here. He's married. He's not dead. Uh, you have Saw with eight movies. You have Candyman with four movies, and you have Friday the Thirteenth with twelve movies. Jeez. Okay, I'm gonna do Friday the Thirteenth only because. I've done Saul not too long ago, and I have done Candy. I did Candyman like a month ago. Right, just um, keep in mind, whenever, because you've already done that, you wouldn't have to do the homework now. I know, but I like expanding <laughs> my knowledge, especially. So with the keep show. in mind, it's it's twelve. I'll movies. be into Joe watching all the Fridays again because that's. A I've good never. Franchise. You guys, as you guys know, <laughs> I have a huge blind spot for the Friday the Thirteenth movies. I, it's that's really a big spotty. one for me. All right. It's so, a blast. I always watch them with the wife, so it's fun. So uh, I will end, so you know, what, guys, and guys, across guys, the board, almost every one is tight ninety. So you can knock out two yeah, a night, no yeah, sweat. And guys, and guys, I work from home, so like, <laughs> it ain't hard. Uh, but you know, keep in mind, uh, uh, everybody's gonna talk about all the movies, so try to condense those. Those were yeah, three well, good I franchises, mean, though. Episode. What bums me out is those are three big franchises that were all eliminated now, and me and TJ are gonna get some shit. If you pick the third so one. I'm gonna I'm gonna give this to TJ because he didn't complain. Um, Damn it! <laughs> all right. So we got the Lost Boys. Oh, that, that has four fun. movies now. Oh, it only has three. That's right. Eliminated. Right, yeah, one more. I thought you need to have at least four movies. That's right. That's right. You have Wishmaster with four movies. You have The Omen with four movies, right? Damn it, I wanted The Omen. <laughs> Can I trade, and, Brian? <laughs> and you have Puppet Master with 14 movies. Jesus. I, I have a nine-pack Puppet Master DVD, and there's been I'm, five more movies. <laughs> I'm going with The Omen. I'll do Wishmaster. At least it's only I've never four. seen Wishmaster. So yeah, I'll Wishmaster. Wishmaster. All right. Yeah. We'll Wishmaster. Wish yeah, because Fuck. Omen's kind of like, you know, oh, it's good. <laughs> Fuck you. The Omen is good. The Omen's incredible. Are we allowed to trade at the end of this? In fact, the Omen trilogy fucking rips. I was just talking about it. All right. You have The Evil Dead. All right. With four movies. You have Purge with five movies. And you have Child's Play with eight movies. Mm. God damn it. Damn. damn. Because here's the thing. Child's Play is already on my watch list for this for this month. The show starts on fucking Tuesday. I know. I don't know if I'm going to go. No, I don't have to do this. I don't have cable. So I might have to. Is it going to come to Wait, Hulu? Time out. Time out. We're doing it yep. for the last month. Oh, what? the show. Child's Play show. I thought you meant we'll record. No, no, no. no. Oh, okay. Sorry. 
I already, the thing is, I already have the Child's Plays on my list to watch. But The Evil Dead is a nice, tight franchise. Only four movies. Uh, I'm going to do The Child's Plays. It's way, I mean, come on, talk about my wheelhouse. All right. Uh, Child's Play for uh, Brian. And I didn't put enough stuff in the hat, so I literally have one left here. Oh, no. Well, okay, it, how about it, this? Yeah, you, you should put everything our back. Best. You can recycle some of our unused ones, too, yeah, yeah. if you need to. It's only nah, yeah. that was, that was Sorry, guys, I'm trying to find a collection of the Friday the 13th movies to buy. So I just... uh, Shout Factory Blu-ray, 120 bucks. Phantasm. Yeah, I, that's a commitment. I feel like Phantasm, Phantasm is a good one. Master might be the same, right, essentially? Mm-hmm. No, those are very different. Oh. Come on, so look I'm at doing that. Fantastic. Look at that, baby. You know you want it. Joe, come I, on. You know you love to collect. Look at that thing. I do, bitch. Oh, man. It's so nice. Get that. It was on oh. sale for so long, too. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, recap. I got the Phantasm with five movies. I've never seen them, so I'm kind of excited, actually. I only saw the first one. Uh,. Brian has Child's Play, TJ has Wishmaster, and uh, Joe has Friday the 13th. Uh, it's going to be good. We have uh, two no, very good no think of Phantasm. I watched two, the first one not so not, like last year. I couldn't get into the Phantasm. I, that's, I'm, I'm interested to see what Yusuf thinks about the series, because I'm the, kind of the same way as Joe wears. I watched the first one, and I was kind of like, eh. And so Wish I'd be Ma- interested to see what, Joe, what Yusuf, Yusuf had to say. TJ, Wishmaster is a little... So I think you're going to appreciate its like camp. Wishmaster has some Freddy energy, I think. Yeah. Wishmaster's got some Freddy energy to it. Freddy. Yeah, it's very Freddy. It's Wes Anderson's uh, also. Uh, so yeah, that's it. Everybody, uh, where can the people find you, TJ? You guys find me at TJ Dex on Twitter. You guys are on the Fly Potato Film YouTube. Like, subscribe, oh, sure. all the nine. Um, fucking La La Land sucks. Yeah. What do you got, Bri? Da, 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 oh, da, da, man. Da, da, if we're da, coming da, out with hot da, takes da. about movies that were Oscar contenders, can I just say The Shape of Water is a turd? And I'm a big GDT oh, fan. No, he didn't. Um, anyway, you want to hear more stuff like that? If you want to hear, you want to argue with me about Go that? Fuck a fish. Find me on Twitter at Hurstcules, and uh, yeah, I had a great time at Joe's wedding. Time of my life. Mm. I miss my boy. I miss I, my fly boys. Uh, I miss I my fly boys there. already too. I to live in La, 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 La Land is stupid fun, and Shape of Water is awesome. T uh, Joe, what's up? Uh, give me, give me another uh, movie that is awesome that sucks. Oh, um. I'm blanking. I don't really have time for that. You don't that. have a hot take? This is the no, Flyers pod. This Flyers pod. All right. Hot take. Um, uh, You know what? I just had a nice time. You can find me at uh, Flyers. <laughs> I'm just a uh, nice boy who had a nice time. Um, uh, be on the lookout for uh, Flyers and Fear. Yeah. Flyers and Fear. We just talked Blair Witch with um, some really nice people. I'm excited for Sam's episode about House. That's on HBO yeah, Max. Yeah, I still gotta Check watch House, House. It's gonna be rad. I, I'll sneak it in with this fucking Nightmare on Elm Street shit I'm gonna keep looking up till I find a good collection. No, no, Friday the 13th. Oh. Goodness. <laughs> That'd be awesome if you watched all the nightmares and then came back and we were like, you're, you were supposed you to watch the Friday. It. You already did that, all, all right. the nightmares. The nightmares are kind of comfort movies, though. I throw them on whenever. Yeah. Uh, all right. Uh, my hot take is Inside Out is dog shit. Bye. 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 Oh, that's spicy as fuck.